is out. Let's try this again. The Junior Dwarfs. And there goes Kylie. Kylie to the lead. And now she's going to give Gabe Lewis a little shot as well. Two laps to go. Two to go for Kylie Forrester. What a performance by Kylie. As Kylie Forrester will see the white flag final time. Kylie Forrester works her way past the 17. Oh, they get together. Forrester and Kersey Young. She turns it around, maintains the lead, and wins the race. Unbelievable. Green flag is out, and I do not know where Mike Harrington was going in the 54. Four wide down the back straightaway. It's Lay, Vernon, Fine, and the 14 of Baker. And all the while, Billy Lay is still the leader as he gets a little bit tangled up with Dylan Baker on the front straightaway, and Baker might be done. And they're three wide for the lead. Down the back straightaway, three wide racing. Seven laps to go. Look at this race for the lead. Two laps left this time, two to go. Mr. Hollywood Race and Vernon wins again. And Billy Lay will bring it home and he will claim the 2013 Mini Stock Championship. We are underway into turn number one. Getting a close look at this great battle as Hager goes to the outside and he cannot get it done. We got ourselves a race for the lead. Eric Brust and the 13 of Chris Dalton have come together. Coming out of turn four, they are just about nose to tail. Two laps to go, two to go. Eric Brust has his sights on his first career modified win. Here comes Dalton on the outside. Whoa, Dalton almost got it, but it will be Eric Brust. He wins it, his first career modified win at Kern County Raceway. Out of turn number four, green flag is out, we're underway. The 11 of Orlando took a look up the inside of the eight of Jeremy Clark. And Flippo will take fourth. Three wide racing, Flippo goes back around Orlando in what has been a good race for that fourth spot. Flippo tries to go wide and instead opens the door for Orlando, but a nice crossover move by Flippo. Five laps to go, Balcazar about to get his first win. If he can hang on in traffic, he'll go around that number one of Minor. He will lead all 20 laps in the Senior Dwarfs. Out of turn number four, it's Anthony Balcazar, your winner. Jerry Flippo, your winner of the track champion, the inaugural track champion at the Senior Dwarf Minis. Green flag is out, we're underway. And Mayhew, the veteran, he jumps on it. Very, very impressive driving by Jeremy Doss. It is no joke. Not a good restart for Jeremy Doss whatsoever. Look at David Mayhew with a power move on the outside. Mayhew to the lead. But he holds it together. The top three are under a blanket. 15 laps to go. Mayhew might be pulling away as Smith made a mistake going into turn one. Smith has a nose on Mayhew, but Mayhew gets away into turn one. Smith had a look. It's still another duel for Tim Smith. He's got a front row seat as he roots him out of turn four. They're side by side with two to go. Smith gave Mayhew a shot and he takes the lead out of turn two. Mayhew's gonna try to come back at him perhaps. White flag in hand, final time, Tim Smith. He makes his way out of turn number two. The prolates putting on a show. Four times a winner and your 2013 champion, Tim Smith does it at Kern County Raceway. He tops David Mayhew and Jeremy Doss in a three car shootout uh, for the ages here at Kern Raceway.
All right, Kern County, here he is, the winner of the final NASCAR Pro Late Model feature in the 2013 Kern County Raceway Champion, Tim Smith.